Hi friends, welcome to Digi Mastery channel. Today we create balance sheet in Excel. How to create balance sheet in Excel? I will tell you step by step the whole process. Let's start. In Excel sheet, I am going to select the four columns and resize them from here. Now I am going to select the first row of the four columns, then go to Home tab and select this option Merge and Center. Now here you write your company name. and then move to second row of these four columns and select and click on merge and center options. Now here you write your company address. If you want to break line here, press Alt plus enter and write remaining address or contact number whatever you want. Now press enter. Now change row size here you can see full address and also resize the company name from here and select both first in company name and second address and align in middle from here. Now left third row and select four row of all of these four columns and select merge and center option. Here we write balance sheet as on. Now here we write liabilities. Move to next cell here. Move to next cell. Here we write rupees RS dot. Now select this cell and write asset. And in this cell we write rupees RS dot. All the liabilities write here and all the assets write here. Select these and center a line from here. Now here we write all liabilities one by one. Select this cell and write capital. What is your company capital is? Total amount right here. Now move to the next cell and we write secured loans. The amount of secured loans of the company right here. Now move downside in this cell. Here we write unsecured loans and the total amount of unsecured loans of the company right here. Now move to next cell and write here current liabilities and total amount of current liabilities right here. Now here we write total in this cell. We want all liability totals here. You can only enter simple sum formula. Write as equal to sign SUM sum bracket start and select this range and press enter. Now we move to assets here. We write fixed asset here and his total amount of fixed asset right here. Move to the next cell and we write investment and total investment amount right here. Now move to the next cell 
and write here loan and advance and all the loan and advance total amount right here that is the amount of the company which is given to the employees of these companies as a loan and advance now move to the next cell here we write total company current assets what is amount of total company current assets we write here now write total here we want all the assets total is equal to sign sum bracket start and select the range and press enter now you can see here assets and liabilities have been matched now here we apply some formatting like this After format, we write here, select this cell and write in term of our report of even date for F dot A and C O dot chartered accountant. Now here we apply bottom border and write here your detail C dot A dot F dot A and C O dot memo number right here and F R N number right here. Now move to this side right here place in the next cell you write date ok select this range and right line this you can see all the text are right lined now we remove these extra lines for this Go to view tab and uncheck this grid lines option. You can see all lines disappear. Now friends our balance sheet process is complete. How to print this? Press Ctrl plus P on your keyboard. Ctrl plus P on your keyboard and you can see print window is open but this is left line when we print on the page all this view is on left line how to center it go to page setup here and select margins tab and click on horizontal and press ok you can see balance sheet is now in center of this page. You see friends, we can create balance sheet in Excel with these simple steps. If you like this, hit that thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. I will see you in next video. 
Thanks for watching.